Hello guys, today we're going to fix this uh, Bluetooth earphone. The type is uh, Meizu EP51. And this is my own stuff I've been using to, for two years. I think the tongue is good. But a couple of months ago, uh, the live channel has no sound. I don't know what happened inside it. Maybe the IC has something wrong, or the coil has an open circuit. I don't know. So let's check it out. First, uh, let's uh, open it, and uh, I'll check it uh, to my laptop, and uh, let's check the sound. And you can see the right channel has sound and the left channel has no sound. No sound there. So uh, I will tear it down and check what happened. The PCB looks good. I can't see anything wrong there. There are four wires uh, each of China. So first let's check the right channel and see the resistance. Two of them, the resistance is zero. Another two. Okay, another two wires the resistance is about uh, 16 ohms. Let's check the left channel. Left channel, two wires of them, the resistance is a zero. And another two wires of resistance is about 15 kilo ohms. So I think the coil is open or it's nearly open, so the resistance is very big. Of course, when the signal input the coil, it cannot send anything. So I will open the shield and uh, check what happened inside. So the coil is out. Sorry, I had made the wire cut it. But I'm very sure the coil is already open. So what we need to do is uh, replacing the coil. Now I have to measure the diameter of the coil. It's about uh, sixty. Uh, sorry, six millimeter. It's very tiny. And it refers to the right channel. The resistance of the coil is uh, sixteen ohms. So it's different from the normal speaker coil, you know. Most of the uh, speaker coil is about uh, 4 ohm to 8 ohms.
and as it is very cheap about uh, one dollar so you see that their measure is uh, six millimeters so finally we find that the coil of the last of the channel is uh, open so resistance of it is uh, 15 kilohms so this is the way that how to check a Bluetooth earphone there is no sound and now how about uh, the coil so we need to so we need to wait for a couple of days and uh, after the coil arrive we'll continue to fix it so that's it see you next time thanks for watching